Our friends often ask us about the best locations in Iceland for bird photography. Those who know our work know that we have been active in bird photography for about two decades. And uh, our career started with bird photography and uh, later landscape photography followed. The problem is that the tourism industry has marketed bird watching and bird photography in Iceland. So one might think that it's possible to photograph birds anywhere. Even though there's a little bit truth in that, it's not the case when you want to get practical information about bird photography in Iceland. This is one of the reasons we decided to write a book about the subject, a practical information guide about bird photography in Iceland. We wrote our book Bird Photography in Iceland, our 40 favorite locations, as a practical guide which we would Considered to be a, an advice from a friend to a friend, sincere, honest, so you would get the most out of your time. If you are planning a trip to Iceland with bird photography in mind, this is for you. This will, this will save you a ton of time. We do our best to recommend only locations that are proven worthwhile for our bird photography. We share 40 of our favorite locations covering each area's accessibility and what birds you can expect to find there, sometimes spilling our guts and secrets about locations that we have so far kept to ourselves, but they have in common that they are open to anyone and everyone's welcome there. At the writing of this book, at least. Drawing from our decades of bird photography, this ebook isn't an exhaustive directory, but it curated collection of 40 top locations and loaded advice based on our experience. Some of the locations have been our secret locations so far. Of course, there are more than 40 locations in Iceland where you can photograph birds. Keep in mind that these are our favorite locations and we try only to select locations that we, we believe will be very practical for others. To visit. We give each location a rating to indicate how practical the area has been for our photography and the rating might give you an idea of what to expect. The great thing about ebooks is that they offer interactive maps, maps that you can use with your phone on the, on the road and uh, you can study, study the maps before you leave home, you can use them on any device and it's very practical in the field. This is easy to do and this is where reflowable ebooks shine. Now I want to show you how, how the ebook works on, on a phone. Uh, let's say I want to find uh, some location here. Let's go to Laxau River near Miwat. Just click on it, come straight up. I can see the rating, I can read about it. And uh, you have some photos that we try to uh, use only photos with each location that we have taken at the location. And uh, you can go to a map and uh, this takes you to photographingiceland.com, our blog. And uh, there you will find the short information about the location. You can go straight to a Google map uh, if you're gonna drive there. You can see how to go there, you can, you can use the map just like you are used to do in, uh, in the Google Maps. You can go for directions. I'm located here in Akureyri, my home. It's 56 minutes from me to drive there and uh, you will find the parking lot and everything. So, and one thing you can do, which I find very, very practical, is that I can use uh, any letter size I want, I, I can use a, a color, I can change the color if I want to and uh, as you can see you can change from uh, now, I, now I'm changing uh, the character size and uh, you can choose do you want to scroll, do you want to fast fade, curl or slide between pages if, uh, if I say slide it means that I have to go do like this to read the next page. You can choose uh, what kind of uh, background you have, dark or uh, if you like this, no problem. You can find more information about our ebook in our blog photographingiceland.com and also in our online store ggart.is. 
Thank you for watching.